Hey everybody, this is the first little episode of Blind Blue. It is a new series that I'm starting here on EHC Film, where I do blind little bits of me playing through a game that I've never played through before. The first one I'm going to start off with, with is Binding of Isaac. It's a game that my buddy Travis has introduced me to. Uh, he said that it would it's a game that I would really like. From what I've looked at, the story is basically Isaac's mom goes crazy Christian and tries to kill him and everything. So he hides out in the basement, and apparently there's creepy stuff in the basement. I don't know. And from what I've seen, this looks like a very depressing video game. So, let us start this off. There's a collections thing, I wonder what this is. Oh, uh, look at that. There's a whole bunch of stuff to find, so apparently there might be something I like. Because I like games where you have to go searching through and finding stuff. Who the heck is Magda already in? How do you say that word? Cain. Judas. Okay, apparently there's all characters you can be, that's sweet. I'll be Isaac. I apologize for the uh, side of my computer around here, because... Alright, let's see how the controls work. Huh. Pretty simple. Shoot diagonal. No, you can't shoot diagonal, apparently. If you hold down the mouse, it looks like you're spitting... Or... Oh wait, he blinks every time. Never mind, he's crying! That's awesome. I like to do a little dance, too. Alright, uh, controls seem to be pretty good. The music is actually really cool, too. I think this is made by the same people who made Super Meat Boy. I don't know, I've never played that game. But it looks like it. So, yeah, I'm gonna go exploring. Oh, god. Why can't I shoot diagonal and make things really easy? I have poor range right now. Looks like Legend of Zelda dungeon style. Oh, god, he ex Oh, flies! That is not cool. If I kill the guy first, does he not shoot flies out at me that chase me and try to kill me? Nope. They still come. Whew. Very Legend of Zelda dungeon-esque. Okay. Let's see, I have bombs. Oh, Jesus. I am expecting to die a bit in this game. Because honestly, uh, when it comes to Legend of Zelda, I love the game, so I'm just not as good as I'd like to think I would be. Apparently there's crap in the basement. It pops. I don't like the look of this door. It looks like there's a boss, but up on the map it looks like there's a coin or something up at the left. I got a bomb, but I can't blow up the door, I don't think. I have to go find a key, because there's a keyhole, and when there's a keyhole, usually means you gotta find a key. Oh, god! Get rid of that fly. I don't know why, these things are just... Everything in this game looks depressing, but the music is awesome. Kind of a metal-ish music. There's nothing in here except another door. Oh god, more flies and things that spawn them. Ah, the flies can fly over rocks. Not cool. <laughs> They're crying? These things are weeping. It's grotesque. It's giving me a very Johnny the Homicidal Maniac feel. Or vibe. When I read those books, I was utterly depressed. Like, well, I was already depressed when I was reading them. It's one of the reasons I was reading them. There seems to be something awesome in here. Let's go in here. I don't like that music. Boom! Oh god, no. Not cool. Not cool. Why do I have the feeling I'm going to explode now? I'm gonna explode. I wanna go open that door first and find out what's in there. Well, that's just depressing. I have one coin, so I can't really buy anything. Yeah, that's very Legend of Zelda right there. That's the old man in the little hut tavern place. From that collections list, it looks like this game has a lot to offer in terms of what you can find throughout the dungeons. I'm just scared. Why Why am I... Got a bomb for a head. It's not cool. I'm going to explode, I bet. That fly... Ugh. I don't know what color it is. It looks red. Is the fly bleeding at me? 
Coins! Coins are everywhere. And I think it said Shift E is a bomb. Oh, just Shift. Never mind. Sweet, I got a lot of bombs. Alright. Looks like I have nowhere else to go but that room with the skull, so let's go find that. I can't get over this music, it's really cool. It's like haunting, but metal. Same time, if that makes any sense. Seems to fit the dungeon crawling very well. The Duke of Flies! Well, that's, this guy doesn't look cool at all. Oh, he spits the flies at me, my head still looks like a bomb, I don't like this at all. Uh, I'm coughing! He's got a lot of flies around him. Oh, God, no. I want to try to hit him with a bomb, see what that does. It seemed to do quite a bit of damage. Happy with that. I'm going to die. I'm going to die in one hit. If I'm going to die, I'm going to try to take him out with me. Oh, the flies are still here. Ooh, I got a heart, though. That's always good. Look at that one, too. The hearts are very disturbing. They're, like, bloody and beating and everything. Die. Sweet. <coughs> Excuse me. Looks like we got a little trap door or something we can go down. I got the belt. Um, don't know what it does. Uh, it said at the bottom of the screen, but I wasn't paying attention. It's hard for me to pay attention because you can make this full screen mode. The thing is, fraps won't record it if it's full screen. No, people are they're pooing on him. What? What is that? What they're doing? What the heck? I still don't understand the bomb for a head. God, what's wrong with this game? And I have a belt that looks like it's wrapping around me like a loincloth. I'm guessing it gave me armor. Hello. Oh god, they can jump. Can I put him out with my tears? Why won't they die? I'm going to just explode. Ah! That sucks. My mouse clicked outside of the screen and I wasn't able to shoot anymore. Dear diary, today I died. I was killed by this thing in some basement. I leave all that I own to my cat, Guppy. Aw, oh, Guppy, Guppy got the bombs and the... Uh, goodbye, cruel world. So does it start me off at the, at the very beginning of the game? Oh god, this is one of those experiences. This is one of those games where it's just cruel for no reason. Cruel for being cruel. I thought this died with a Nintendo. I wish, I wish it died with a Nintendo. I hate it when games are just unnecessarily mean to you. If I want to play a game, I want to have fun. I don't want to have to start over every single time I die. More likely than not, if you haven't played a game before, you're going to die. Die, fool. Die. I cry on you. It does take some getting used to. I'm not used to the whole uh, aim one direction while you're running another direction. I played it when I was playing uh, zombie that that zombie game that PlayStation Network gave to everyone for free. Sweet, I got a bloody heart. Sweet, I got bombs. Can't use the bombs. I want to go in here. What is that thing? And why is there poo right next to it? Pop. Pop. Look at the little smiley faces out of the poo. This Isaac's one twisted kid. Laser tears. Whoa, dude. That's both disturbing, but awesome at the same time. I look like a Terminator. I shall terminate you with my sadness! Oh, shift or E. I thought it was a saying shift E. Uh, my laser tears can't shoot through rock, apparently. But they go all the way across the screen. That's really nifty. Oh yeah, I'm liking this. I'm liking this a lot. What is that? It's like a piece of rotten meat that is bleeding everywhere. Ugh. 
Oh, this laser is actually more powerful than the tears too. That's always nice. Can kill an enemy faster. Let's get rid of some of this poo. See if there's any monies. Nope, but I got a key. There was a door up there with coins, I think. What's up here? Oh, that's a room with a headless doll guy or whatever. I'm really liking the whole, despite the fact that you die really fast. What is that thing? Despite the fact that you die and you go to the very beginning of the game again, I do like the whole random generating uh, dungeons and items in the dungeons. So you never know whether or not the dungeon is going to screw you over with an item that like doesn't do any good, or if it's going to give you something awesome like a laser eye that like destroys half your face. He's still, yep, he's still crying out of that eye, so apparently it's not that destructive. I can't go up, so we must go down. And we go around. Into the demonic looking room. Aw, oh, this guy again. I'm wondering if it's the same boss every time. Oh yeah. Laser eyes. Good. Stay at the other end of the screen and just poke at him. Chip away his health. I'm liking this a lot. Ah, flies! That was easy and awesome. Oh, I can't pick up... I think I can hear the hearts beating. This game disturbs me, as I'm sure the developers intended. Let's get this belt again. Speed up! Now I got sp Yeah, Cyborg Isaac! He's so depressed. So I'm wondering if that's the end of the game and if it just continuously switches the levels and you play through over and over again. Oh, I can't open it without a key. Why is that guy green? I don't like it. I'm not a green fan. I like... I could put out the fire. Ah, it turns into a bomb. Oh, then you destroyed the other guy. Ow! He turned into a bomb too. There's items in the fire. I'm liking this. My buddy Travis was right. Pails here! Uh, it's a funny little joke. I don't know what they do. I'm not sure I want to test it out, because what if they give me health and I only use it when I have one health? I'll do it anyway. Bad gas. Okay. That didn't do anything. This game. A mini boss? Well, that's cool. Why can't I hit him? There we go. I'm wondering why I couldn't hit him. Oh god. I guess you. Oh, you turn life into money. I thought it was you turn the money into life. Never mind. My bad. This game is coming up a little laggy-ish on my computer. Might be, because I'm having to record the entire desktop, because this game isn't recognized by recognized by Fraps as a game. Oh god, no. Suck on the bomb. That bomb only got one fly. It was a waste. Oh, I didn't want to go to the boss yet. What the heck is this? Larry Jr.? Where's Larry Sr.? Oh god, it's just like the worm guys from Legend of Zelda! Stay back, Larry. Wait, you only said Larry Jr. Which one of these is Larry Jr.? Which one's the other one? Oh, you can destroy them piece by piece. A radioactive spider has appeared in the basement. Does that mean I can turn into Spider-Man? Wait, I got a Steam achievement called Radioactive Spider. There's a door right there. What the heck is this place? I don't know what I want to get the creepy symbol. Brimstone, holy crap. What the heck is this? What is this? What is this? I can't get health either. Lunch? 
Does that up my health? Yes, it does. What? Why? <laughs> Why am I a little demon now? <laughs> He's falling! Oh, and he landed and broke his back. That's not cool. Why am I a little angry demon? This is... This is weird. Ah. Oh, God! I just ni annihilated them! XVI. What's XVI? That is... 16 the tower? Oh, God, no! That was horrible! I don't know what that guy is, but I want to spit Hellfire at him. Oh, I can drag it? Oh, no, I guess not. God, this is weird. Good thing is, I don't think I could fall down the pits. Bad thing is, this guy's gonna kill me. Whew! I need some hearts. What? What is that? I'm dead. Ah, uh, dear diary, dead. I was killed by this like some cave. I leave all that I own to my pet cat, Gubby. Goodbye, cruel world. Uh, this, it shows I can click on them, I just don't know what it is. Well, uh, this is basically all I'm going to do for right now. This is a pretty interesting game. Uh, my thoughts are that the story is basically about some depressed dude. Yeah, I don't know, the writer might have some psychological problems or something, I don't know. Obviously he's not a fan of Christianity. Um, but all in all, this is a really cool looking game, and I'm looking forward to playing more of it and seeing how far I can get. I want to make it to the last of those rooms to fight the big giant boss at the end. I, I don't get why I turned into a little demon. I probably wouldn't have died if I had kept my lasers and everything, but that hellfire just destroys everything. Uh, well, that was fun. This has been the first part of Blind Blue. Uh, ex expect, me, expect me to do more of these. Uh, they're not all going to be on the same game. If obviously, it's all going to be games that I haven't played before. Uh, so yeah, adios.